For this week's Sports Star Spotlight, we're paying a visit to a story program in Southern California. Located just south of Anaheim in Santa Ana, California, Modern Day is a brand that's recognized throughout the state and across the country. The brand is obviously worldwide. I mean, people can go anywhere, wear a modern day football or just a modern day uh, insignia and somebody will say, hey, you know, that's at school in Santa Ana. It's got great football. It's got great basketball. You know, as an educator, you wish they'd say, well, you know, we have a great math department, but they don't, uh, although we do. When I took over in, in 1989, being a former player, I felt we had to do it the way we did it back in the, in the 60s when I played. Play great defense, create a brotherhood where kids depend on each other, where the three stripes on our helmets, pride, poise, and courage, mean something. And that's how I've built it. The football program has long been associated with winning, as well as a dynamic passing game. But this year, one of the team's star players is a running back, Relique Brown. But that doesn't necessarily mean modern day's offense is going to change. It's actually going to be a lot more of the same, but Brown adds an exciting dimension to the Monarchs' attack. But here's what's an interesting thing. You know, everybody thinks all we do is throw it around the yard, and we do throw it. We probably became enamored with the pass game in the 90s and probably threw it more than anybody threw it in the 90s. But when you, when you look at our statistics overall, we're always 45 and 55. You know, maybe 42, you know, uh, uh, running the ball. So what we're going to try to present with the Relief Brown is we're going to try to create the mismatches through motions. To me, I bring a lot to a team. Like, um, I'm a running back, but I'm not just a running back. I, I could catch the ball. I could go to receiver. I could play slot. I could play corner. What you want to do is create opportunities for him to touch the ball, whether it's from the slot over, from the slot back into the backfield, from the backfield out to the slot, or even line them up at wide receiver and create havoc that way. So I can do all type of stuff, but I, I barely get hit, like uh, dodge hits on. I was trying to go score, so. He has an explosiveness that you can't coach. He does things that you, you go, okay, well, you know, I can't teach that. How did he see that? How did he do that? How did he know to dip it and then just explode to the outside? He's blessed with incredible, incredible athletic talent. I think it's just a God gift, and I just put it to use. But yeah, I for sure do like, I just see something just go. Brown is originally from Stockton, which is in Northern California near Sacramento. He transferred to modern day last season, but COVID caused his first year as a Monarch to be quite unusual with a short football season in the spring and limited practice time. But he's still got a taste of what this program is like, and now he's ready to immerse himself with a full season as a Monarch, which means competing for championships, both in California and nationally. Got a little feel for it. It was more of a high level football, so. I think he's adapted well. It, it, it was a de definite different transition for him because it's also an academically challenging school, but he was willing to do the work. He's adapted to that. But when it's go time, you know, he wants to be part of it. Uh, and, and I enjoy that about him. He still has that high school, you know, life is good attitude. This is a high level football down here, so I just came to get better, get ready for college. And I think this was the best spot to prepare me for college football. Brown is committed to Oklahoma for next season. He loves the vision the coaching staff there has for his long-term future. When I visit there, I just felt home. Lincoln Rally, a great coach. All the coaches around there, Coach Simmons. For me, it just feel like home for me. I truly believe Raleigh Brown could, could end up in the NFL. He's smart enough to know that there are certain universities that fit his style. I think he's made a wise commitment to, to Oklahoma. Uh, they do a tremendous job there. I have great respect for that university and how they care for their athletes and treat their athletes. And he needs that continued structure. And he needs to be, you know, where he can exhibit his talents. First, I want to get to college and go to NFL. Uh, that don't mean a lot for me because that's all I've been working for since I was little. Thanks for checking out Sports Stars of Tomorrow on YouTube. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a like and please subscribe to our channel so you see all of the latest content.